highly pathogenic avian influenza, more commonly known as bird flu, was confirmed in southern Oklahoma earlier this week. Contaminated birds can spread this deadly virus as the colder air moves in and the birds head south. This is a highly contagious virus, and so it is something that we want to address head on. Rosalyn Biggs, an OSU Extension veterinarian, says avian influenza usually begins spreading in the fall as birds migrate, and it has been increasing over the last decade. I would say since really 2013, 2014, we've seen a higher incidence of reports of of avian influenza really across the United States. I asked Rosslyn about the associated risks. First and foremost, we want to make sure it's clear that eggs and poultry are, are safe to consume, they're safe to eat. She said it's not impossible for humans to get the virus, but it is unlikely. It's exactly the opposite for poultry, though. The thing about this disease is particularly in our in our poultry populations, this disease with very rare exception, leads to death in these birds. Poultry owners are encouraged to stay aware of symptoms like sneezing and keep wild birds separate. You know, we don't want our poultry owners to be scared. We want them to be aware and we want them to take the appropriate action. While depopulation through euthanasia is necessary for birds that have been exposed, it's important to report any suspected illness for the protection of others and to keep avian influenza as contained as possible.